your child has been sleeping super late uh, and then you expect them to go to sleep at eight, you can't just do that, right? So you want to do it gradually, right? <laughs> so from 10 p.m. or 10.30 p.m. and then doing increments like 15 to 30, 20 minutes earlier every night to kind of get you where you need to be. So kind of look at your calendar, look at the first day of school and go backwards from that so you can kind of gradually get your child back on a schedule. So that would be number one. Number two is talking to your child about how they're feeling. You know, we're going into a new school year where, you know, some kids are just, were just remote all of last year. Some were hybrid, some were, you know, homeschooled, you know, so um, and, and, you know, a lot of uncertainty and depending on where you live, uh, some schools may be lifting mask mandates, right? And again, some kids may be fearful about that, you know, or they may feel better because they hated the mask. So you want to sit with your child and talk to them. Like, how are you feeling about school? 